Next, we'll take a look at a great new feature that was added to create form tools from 2D geometry within SOLIDWORKS. Here's a 3D model and a 2D sketch of the form tool we want to create. Let me start by hiding the model, and we'll work with just the 2D sketch geometry. I'll go to the Wire EDM tab, and from the EDM plane, I'll right-click and select the EDM Form Tool selection from the menu. This is used for creating form tools, so I'll select the geometry now. And then I'll choose, go around and pick each of the elements that make up the sketch of the form tool that I want to create. Let me select each of these elements. And I'll pick all of the lines and different geometry that I need to select to create the form tool. I'll say OK. And you can see the toolpath that's being created. And let me change the number of skim passes here so that we can look at only the finished toolpath. I'll also turn the glue stop off because I don't want to use it. And then let's go up and edit some of the parameters for the operation here. So I'll edit the operation here and I'll make some adjustments here under the form tool parameters and select the direction. And also let's change the stock thickness to the stock that we'll be using, thickness of the stock for the form tool. Um, also the face taper angle I want to specify as well as the side taper angle for the form tool. And finally, the form tool length as well. So let me input that. And I think that will do it. Try the preview here. Well, I need to reverse the direction I can see. Okay, and say OK here. Okay, and here you can see the toolpath that's been created. And let me go over now and uh, show the form tool again, the model of the form tool that we wanted to create. And then let me change the, the view angle here. And if I move it around, then you can see how the toolpath precisely matches the form tool that we wanted to create using the 2D geometry.